Well, the city of L.A. has said it's cracking down hard on illegal fireworks with arrests and prosecutions. But is that really the case? The NBC4i team found few people actually face legal consequences for illegal fireworks. Here's investigative reporter Eric Leonard. With the warnings each year, all fireworks are illegal in the city of Los Angeles. Police and fire officials say, aside from the extreme danger of injuries or accidental explosion or fire, there's little tolerance if people are caught with fireworks, which are only permitted in L.A. at professional shows. It is dangerous, and we will be out there trying to educate and prevent, but ultimately, if you have to, we will enforce. Earlier this week, LAPD Chief Michael Moore said last year's numbers showed public complaints about illegal legal fireworks spiked. We saw a 72% increase in calls for service. So it was a surprise to see there were only a handful of arrests recorded. LAPD data shows in all of 2020, Los Angeles police officers arrested seven people on suspicion of using or selling fireworks, and six of those were in Van Nuys over two days. So far this year, the LAPD says it's arrested six people on fireworks-related charges, including the man arrested in South LA Wednesday after more than two tons of fireworks were found and one of the LAPD's bomb disposal trucks was destroyed when officers detonated some of them. We asked the LAPD and the LA City Attorney's Office, which prosecutes most of these cases, for more information about the arrests that we found and the level of punishment. They were unable to find that data on short notice today. One other interesting note, it appears none of the arrests that happened last year were on July 4th or in the days before and after, which the police and fire departments designate each year for increased enforcement. I'm investigative reporter Eric Leonard, NBC4 News.